when all the lockdowns started, we were traveling around Australia, me and my family, in a bus. And we got locked down at this caravan park that had a petting zoo there. There were so many little baby sheep, like days old. And we ended up raising them in that caravan park for about a year. When all the lockdowns finished, the owner was like, we're going to be getting rid of them now because it's a petting zoo. And sadly, that's what they do in petting zoos when little babies get too old. They're just apparently not cute or good enough for the little kids that go in there. And we could not bear the fact of thinking that we were never going to see the sheep again. So one of our friends, they had a farm and they were like, yeah, we, we'll have your sheep for you. And we decided that's better than not having them at all. Um, out of all the other sheep, Pixie just adores me and I adore her. She will follow me around all day, every day, wherever I am. She's right by my side. Whenever you pat her, she will lay her head on you and fall asleep there. Pixie, my sheep, she's got a very different face shape than all the other sheep. She's got this constant smile on her face. She's definitely the funniest of the group. Her ears are very different to all the other sheep as well. Whenever she sees you, her ears will just perk from the front of her face. But she's very different to me than what she is to other people. They're all very different, so they've all got their personalities. The boys, you can tell because they act very tough from all the other ones. But they're such softies, they want to have as much love as the other ones. It's really amazing because you didn't expect that from these farm animals. And the normal house pets that people will normally have and love. I don't see a difference towards them. They just brought our whole family so much more love and more joy. It just makes me so happy to see how much joy what I'm doing is bringing to other people. And I do feel really special to have them. It's time to watch more.